hello everyone welcome to our youtube channel in this video we will guide you through the process how to fix all at wi-fi not showing up okay so guys we are going to discuss by each step so first step is check wi-fi bands ensure both your OLED device and your phone tablet are connected to the 2.4 GHz band okay and then verify base station connection confirm that your base station is connected to wi-fi especially if you have dual brand router like 2.4 GHz and 5.0 GHZ okay and then secure network make sure your Wi-Fi network is secure and password protected okay fourth is network selection if you are using dual band router connect to 2.4 GHZ network during setup and then power cycle base station try power cycling the base station by disconnecting it for five minutes and then reconnecting it unplug the base station from the wall socket wait for at least five minutes before plugging it back in this duration allow for a fully power cycle and reset after reconnecting the base station check the bottom for a small indicator light label wi-fi a brightly illuminated light indicator successfully connected to wi-fi okay and then check smart sock battery app check open the OLED app to view the battery level of the smart sock when the base station light is plusing white it means the sock is charging when the light is static white it indicates that the sock is fully charged okay low battery notification if the smart sock battery has less than one hour of operation time you will receive a blue notification in the app okay then base station will not play a sound flash for the notification okay guys this is our sixth step so seventh step is uninstall and reinstall the OLED app how to uninstall the app first of all navigate to your device setting scroll down general tab tap on it and select iphone storage and search for OLED app tap on the app and choose offload app to uninstall it how to uninstall that open the app store on your device search the OLED app and get button to install the app on your device okay and then contact support if the problem persists reach out the OLED support for further assistance visit the OLED help center page like click on this and you can go to this side and here you can contact them whatever type of your issue has been facing okay guys so this is our all step thanks guys have a nice day don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel